Hello friends, sometimes we want to repeat the color of famous photographers. We have been working in Photoshop and Lightroom for a long time, but don't understand how to reproduce the palette. Neural networks can help us. Today I'll show you the potential of Adobe Neural Network and its ability to repeat the color of famous photographs. Let's get started. There are two key steps to take to use the neural filter. First, select your photo to be corrected and open it in Photoshop. Secondly, in Photoshop you can also need to open an example photo for repeat the color. This must be done in a separate tab or remember the location on the computer. So let's open the photo, click the filter tab, neural filter and find the color transfer. Then we select Custom and find our example from the second tab or select a photo on the computer. You must click on the folder icon. We immediately see the final result. We can change the brightness, saturation, hue, luminance. Why do I prefer the LED color space? It allows you to adjust the color and brightness with individual settings. If we switch to sRGB, there will be much less settings. We set up our photo, open it. It seems to me that the neural filter did a very good job. One more example. I'll do it without further comment. A very good result. The neural network coped and repeated the color of the example. It's important to say that these shots we made in studio and had approximately the same conditions. This helps the neural network to cope with the task very well. Let's try to look at another example. I have a desire to repeat the color work of any Leibovitz. I upload my photo and Annie's photo. I open the panel with neural filters. Select an example. We get the result. I don't like skin colors. In general, there is a mismatch, but this can be improved. Create an additional adjustment layer color balance. We are trying to reproduce the skin color from our example. Then invert the mask with Ctrl and I and with a white soft brush paint over the area of our model. Yes, we had to modify the photo a bit, but in general a neural filter did its great job. With the help of this filter we have the opportunity to repeat the color of famous photographers in just one click and not suffer with curves and selective color correction. Photoshop has an other way to repeat the color from example. To do this we got to image, adjustments, color match and select an example in the source item. However, this method doesn't always work well. I think the neural filter is the best option to repeat the color. The accuracy of algorithm is much higher. Friends, do you use Adobe neural filters in your work? Write in comments. Thank you for watching this video. Subscribe to the channel, click the like button, leave comments. See you soon in the next videos.